In this video, we're going to review an example of a WooFoo form being integrated with Salesforce.com. I already have a WooFoo form set up and configured, so we're going to review those settings. In the notification section, you can see Salesforce is already set up, so I'll just go in here and review the setup. This is starting from the end and going backwards, so let me back up a couple times. The first thing that's set up is the salesforce.com email, the password, and the authentication token of the account at Salesforce. This has already been entered. Then the next screen allows you to select the type of contact, or excuse me, the type of object. In this case, it's a lead. And then the next step from there is the title and the body. So here, this was configured entered in already and these are default values being pulled from Wufu. Uh, you can put anything you want in here and one thing I didn't show that I'm going to show right now is the field matching. So we'll take a look at the field matching and here are the default fields in the Salesforce lead where we can map them with what's coming from the Wufu form. I already have these set up first name and last name company name, email, and then there's a bunch of other field mappings and the default lead in Salesforce that are not configured. That's something that can be done after the fact. So this is how you set up the configuration and we'll go from here and start testing submissions with the form.